Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel for yet another gameplay. I am your host, That Dragon Guy, and today we are playing The Bridge, the puzzle game. And last time we played number six, the memorial. Stump me. Let's see if we can get through it this time. All right. So we have the ball on the statue. We have a lock. And of course, if we have a lock, we have a key. And that key is hanging from a chain over there. Now, obviously, we have to get rid of the vortex in order to get to the key. But the thing is, once we get to the, rid of the vortex and we get over here, uh-oh. I messed up. Okay. So once we get over to the vortex and get over here, how do we keep the ball from hitting us? But me messing up a second ago kind of gave me an idea. What if we slightly make the ball roll just enough so it comes off? Yeah, it falls into the vortex. And then we can get over to the button by doing this. And we don't end up losing the ball like we did in the last video. So now, let's just keep spinning. And that's what happens to the key. All right. Well, how do we grab it? I see a little piece of wood or ground right there. Will the key lay on that piece of wood? Yes, it will. And the ball's still safe in the vortex. Oh, 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 too much, too much. I put too much and the key fell off. That was stupid. I don't even know why you were turning it still. I mean, we just really had to get it flat. Now, how do we get the ball back here without killing me? Maybe I can just do what the ball did a minute ago to get in the vortex. Just do this. Oh crap, I stepped off too far. Alright, so, no, no. And I turned it too much. Alright, now the ball is not okay. The ball is still not okay. Alright, so now the ball is safe. So now we just gotta get the ball back up there to the button, and it's solved. All right. So my mess up at the very beginning of the stave helped me solve it. Awesome. So on to the next one. As soon as I get to the door. All right, so there we go. Chapter two complete. We won a trophy. And it says academic. Awesome. We're like children with bottomless with a bottomless toy box, creating and exploring. Limited by only our imaginations, we cast aside the theories of old and invent the new ones beyond method or reason. Our own world. Okay. So moving on to chapter three, I wonder how many chapters there are. I only see one more door. Walk between the impossible is easier than it seems. Walking in between the impossible. I only see one more door, so maybe there's only three chapters, but what if after we complete this chapter, something else is expanded onto the house or we move on to a different house? I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Let's continue. Chapter 3. Alright. The Inversion. Oh, great. Oh, this looks like a lot of fun. I don't much like the picture. 
I feel like this is going to be a little bit difficult. Don't let me get stumped on Puzzle 2 for the day. I mean, come on. Alrighty then. So, where the hell is the door? Oh, I see the door. Alright, well, I have an idea. We could just try to walk on that wall, but there is no wall there to walk on. We don't need a key. And, alright, I got it, I got it. So, slowly turn this and walk up it. Then we're going to walk down it. Uh-oh. I don't know what I just did. I don't even know where I'm at. Okay, there I am. Alright, so now we just walk back this way and we'll end up walking to the door. Right? Yeah, that that seems to be right. I need this guy to actually be able to walk up the hill, though. Alright. And, yeah, we're coming up on the door. Alright. We did it. That was easier than I expected it to be. Alright. Cool. Cool. Moving on to number two. Whether this one stumps me or not, this will be the last puzzle of the day. I normally only do three puzzles per video. Whether the final puzzle stumps me or not, I normally just end it there. So let's continue. We got a clock. We got a key or something? Uh, I don't know. I didn't see it. Ooh, this is going to be... That ball is going to be chasing me. And that one ball that's white goes the opposite way than the other ball. Alright. So if we just keep going like this, oh, well, I didn't get the key. We gotta be able to get, how the hell do you get the key? Look at the key, it's going like the up. You know what, I've got an idea. Those arrows on the middle of the clock, last time the arrows did something. You know, it would like change my position of, or something or another. So, what if I do it again? Uh-oh, no. Yeah. And now we walk back the opposite way. No, 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 we don't walk back the opposite way. Keep going the way you were going. And now we'll grab the key because the key is going to be there for us. There we go. And now we just keep walking and we'll end up on the door. All right, and there we go. So we figured it out. Oh, we can't do it when inverted, what? Man, all right, fine. So that means we gotta do this again. And then which way do we gotta walk to get to the door? We should walk this way to get to the door. Yeah, so there we go. So that was a little annoyance that I didn't think about, but we still got it. There we go. So the aftermath, number three, is the one that's on there next. But as I said, the last puzzle was the last puzzle for today. So... I'm going to thank you all for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I'm glad I didn't get stumped by any of the puzzles today. Maybe I'll get stumped by the puzzles the next time we play. Um, that being said, thank you for watching. If you liked watching me solve the puzzles on the bridge, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I thank you very much for watching. I've been your host, That Dragon Guy, and I'll see you tomorrow. Because I post every single day. Thank you for watching. I love you guys. Bye.